There's another voice I want to bring in. Ryan Petty lost his daughter in the Stoneman Douglas school shooting. He has a very special message for student activists. If you want to stop school shootings, don't walk out, walk up. Walk up to a student sitting alone or who has no friends and let's make a difference that way. Ryan Petty joins us live from Fort Lauderdale. And first of all, Papa, the pain you and, and loss you've experienced is not something I wish on anyone. And I um, wrap my arms around you in a very loving and warm embrace. I need you to know that before we even have our conversation, okay? Thank you. Thank so you. this idea of walk up, not walk out, where did the idea come from? Well, uh, it's not an idea I created. It's mm -hmm. something that I saw posted on my Facebook wall uh, by a mutual friend. And the idea really resonated with me because I, like the other parents of the victims of the massacre at uh, Marjorie Stoneman Douglas High School, would like to be the last parents to ever have to deal with this kind of tragic loss. And it occurred to me that as I've, as I've tried to study this issue and tried to understand, tried to make sense of why this happened, I've been looking for solutions to prevent this from happening again. And, it, and, and, and this really resonated with, with me based on some things that I had learned, this idea of making sure there isn't anybody that doesn't have a friend or somebody to talk to, somebody to um, call a friend, somebody to share concerns or dark feelings with. And uh, this walk-up movement to me seems to be, seems to go to the core of what we need to do to fix our culture. And the problems is that the last guest mentioned, they go far deeper than, than, uh, than just problems at school. These are problems, uh, societal problems, problems that impact our families. They actually start in the family and the breakup of the family and then, and then impact society at large. Do you think, with all due respect, do you think that would have helped in this instance? It sounds as though the shooter was a deeply, deeply disturbed young man. Uh, he was, and the more we learn about, uh, the more we learn about him, the more we're realizing that we're, there were a bunch of mistakes made yeah. um, by the school district, by law enforcement, by others that uh, could have prevented uh, what happened in Parkland. That's the real sad thing here is that this could have been prevented. In the case of this shooter, um, and what I learned from the Secret Service this week, who studied this since Columbine, this, the Secret Service has interviewed these school shooters. They've learned a lot about them, and what I've learned is there's a point of no return. In this case, it could have been the death of the shooter's mother last October that was the point mm -hmm. of no return. At that point, at that point, it becomes a mental health and law enforcement issue. But prior to that point of no return, things like walk up can be helpful. Um, if for no other reason, then these shooters tend to tell somebody else yeah. that they're going to do this. In this case, the shooter broadcast it all over social media. So if there is a friend, if there is somebody to listen to, that's somebody that could reach out on behalf of these disaffected youth and get them help. So that's why I think walk up so important. How are you and the family doing? You know, it's, uh, it's day by day. Um, we miss our daughter Elena very much. I, I miss the things especially that I wanted to do with her as a father, uh, to see her graduate from, from high school, to see her graduate from college, to see her get married, to walk her down the aisle. I won't get to do those things uh, with Elena, but um, our faith uh, tells us that we will see her again. We, we'll be reunited and, and we'll be able to hold her and embrace her and that is helping us get through as a family. My prayers are with you. Ryan Petty. Thank you. Thank you for your good heart and for sharing your good word. You take care of yourself and your family, okay? Thank you. All right.